Things are going very well indeed over in Norway. Hello everyone, welcome back to Failure December FM with me. My name is Chris. Hope you're all doing very, very well. We're top of the league. We're equal on points with, with Ra Ralfos football. We played five, won four, drawn one, lost none. We are on top of the league with a goal difference of 10 compared to Ralfos's four. It's been really good. So we played Skeed and uh, Ranheim in the first episode. Then we beat local rivals or fierce rivals, I forget which. Uh, Jerv beat them 2-0. We beat Crockle... Croc Crockle... Croak of Dylan in the cup, 3-1. Then we beat Burn, 2-0. Uh, and just recently we've drawn 0-0 nil -nil with, with Songao. Neither team really doing enough attacking-wise to win that game, but both both sort of goalkeepers got over a 7 rating. And I think Virgil Storv actually got man of the match. So we're not going to win them all. We're not going to win them all, but we are unbeaten. And that, that is very pleasing. Today, it was going to be Sarpsborg and Frederikstad, but we drew Viking, Elitur El oh, I'm going to say it wrong, Elitserien Viking at home in the next round of the cup. So I thought we've got to, we've got to do that. You know, Viking are a, but you know, Viking are a big team. They've won the they won the the top league. The 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 they've won the the Elite Syrian eight nine times or something like that. Let's have a look. Eight times they've won it. They're a big team, and to draw them at home, I think it's uh, I think it's really special. Squad wise. Everyone's playing well. We're even getting a tune out of Kevin Bloody Gedimini. Look at that. He's an average rating of seven. That's the best he's ever played for us so far. And everyone is playing pretty, pretty well. Even, even sort of players who are coming in and out of the team, you know, for the fitness and rotation. We're getting some good ratings out of all of them. Um, and it's, yeah, life is good, which means that this episode is going to be two losses. We'll be dumped out of the cup by Viking and uh, we'll get beaten in the league by Stordal's Blink. You know, rapid fire episode this one without any further ado we're going to get into the games today i've already I've, I've i've journeyed forward to the day we need to be on which is incredible i never do that i never ever remember to do that they're going to be they're playing apparently a gagan pressy type system so what i'm going to do is try and counter that a little bit by being a bit more direct with our passing and then passing into space because they're going to be pressing and leaving loads of gaps so we're going to try it out the team uh, there's a couple of changes because there's a little bit of unfitness. So um, who normally plays in the middle there? But Langeland is a little bit unfit, so he's going to be replaced by Marvin Martin Torp, rather. And then Christian Eriksen is coming in for Lil Lovo, who is very tired. Very, very tired indeed. But the rest of the team is as such. Is as such? Is as follows. Storves in goal. Gedimini, Race, Killerich and Pabai in the back line. Torp and Salt in the middle. Bettini, Eriksen, Mindseth make up the attacking trio behind Main man, Andreas Hellem, who is, like, he doesn't look it, but he is a monster. He just, he he likes scoring. I've only got the one stand, and it seems completely full of away fans. It's, like, just there. It's just Viking fans by the looks of it. We don't have any other stands, I don't think. Do we have, no, we don't. We, there's nothing behind either goal. So where do our fans sit when an away team bring a lot of, a lot of fans with them? I don't know. First highlight of the game goes their way, but we've nicked in and stolen that. Bettini, brilliant. Oh, dribbles through two. Poor shot. He could have cut that back for Helen, but Bettini, wonderful stuff there. How have they already had four shots? It's been eight minutes. Yeah, look, they are pushing really high up, really high up, but we have managed to push them back. Average position-wise here, it looks like the, the, you know, the battle is definitely in the middle of the park. They are very narrow. Can we exploit that by going very wide and focusing play out on the wings? I think so. Let's give it a go. See how we get on for the next sort of 15 minutes before the halftime interval. Nothing's really happening. I'm just talking to fill air, really. Um, Virgard Storr's having a very good game. He saved uh, two shots, even though they've only had one on target, which is interesting. Nothing is happening. This game is mm, brilliant. Brilliant stuff. Halftime, one highlight, and that's it. Great. Good, good stuff. Good stuff. I think Ericsson probably come off for Ringborg because he's Ericsson's not playing particularly well. And Helm picked him up before the game, not performed particularly well. So we'll have Erstensen come on instead. And I think that's going to be it. Uh, maybe we'll go positive and we'll try and try and force the issue a little bit. You know, we're at home and we've we've matched them in the first half. Corner though for Vikings swung in goal straight after half time. Well then, bugger. That's really poor. That's a really poor corner. Goal, well, really poor goal to concede. More highlights. Right, another one for Viking, unfortunately. Van Acker on the ball, gives it out wide, swings it in, Storves collects that, though. Are we going to build from the back here? I hope so. Or are we going to punt it? No, throws it out to Race, gives it back to Storves, back to Race. 
Uh, let's not dick around at the back, boys. Erstenson under this, not quite. Marvin Martin, I keep calling him Marvin. Mind's death on the ball now. Gets tackled in the middle of the park. Loses out. Viking have got another chance to come at us here. Good interplay from them. Are we going to get in the tackle? We're not. Borshaw is really quick. It's a header. It's 2 0. We're out of the cup. Unbelievable. What's happened? What's happened here? We've just crumbled at half time. Absolutely crumbled. Salt is on the ball. It's muscled off it again by Sabakan. Solbakan. We just we're losing the ball in the middle of the park. Can't seem to keep hold of it. They've scored. Not they haven't. Off the bar. Oh, this is rubbish. What has happened? Hmm. Nobody's playing like apart from Killerich. Nobody's playing like terribly, terribly. I don't understand quite why we've just sort of fallen to pieces. That's um. Hmm. What can we do? Right, Bertini's knackered. So actually, Ersenson can go out wide. Haberstad can go up top. No, don't do that. Why has it done that? Out wide. Haberstad. Martin Torp is not having a good game. We'll have Fredrickson on. Can't make any more substitutions. Right, bugger it. So we've brought Haberstad on and put uh, Ersenson out wide instead. But those two goals have just absolutely destroyed us. Really, really poor. Just, we, we didn't come out for the second half. It's awful from us. Another highlight for Viking now. They're in again down that left-hand side. Left-hand side for them, right-hand side for us. Uh, Freese to Sobakken. He's in here. That's a great goal. That is a great goal. I mean, that's a, you know, yeah. I'll see you at the end of the game. 3-1, it finished it in the end. We got a late consolation goal from Edvard Race with a header. Oh, God. I don't understand what happened. We were matching them up to half time and then we come out for the second half concede two really quick goals and then a third and it's just done yeah shocking stuff from us absolutely shocking really disappointed i can't get too annoyed because they are sort of like premier league opposition but fuck me just awful killerich you were well below well below the required standards yeah i'm a bit pissed off not gonna lie a little bit pissed off hmm hmm I'm, I'm annoyed enough that I'm not going to the press conference. When we've got six days and we're playing Stordown Blink, who are 12th. I want a big win to make up for that because that was mm, shocking. Shocking stuff. First highlight comes early though, and it's us with the ball. Killerich in the middle of defence, punts it forward to nobody at all. The under that, he is kind of... I mean, he is. He won the ball, but then they got the, the follow-up. They're in. Oh, my God. Oi. Guys, come on. What are you doing? Highlight, 25 minutes on, free kick, swung in, Langerland's under it. Oh, it's all nearly bundled over the line. Not quite. Oh, we've got an injury. Oh. Bettini, I was trying to give Bettini a rest, but um, injuries conspired to make that not the case. Another free kick, Fredrickson over it, swings it in. Killerich is at the back. It's just wide. We're much better than we're playing at the moment. Much, much better. We had a highlight then, and I changed the mentality, and it went away. What's all that about? 40 minutes on the clock. We're going into half time 1 0 down. Helm on a 6.3. Jesus. What is going on? I'm, I'm, just, I'm throwing the water bottle. Terrible. Terrible. <laughs> Absolutely rubbish. Mindseth, on you go. Haberstad, on you go. And I think that's all the subs I've got. We're going to go back to attacking. Yeah. Mindseth in as an inside forward on attack. That's, I just want. I, we've got to win this. I can't. I don't want to lose two in a row. No, because Ralphos must be winning. No, Ralphos are drawing. No, now they're winning. Brilliant. Now they're winning. Right. So they're going to go three points clear at the top. We cannot score. Apparently, the free kick for them. Lil Lebo over it. Just going into the back of the net. Oh, Stores with a great save. Oh, and then another great save. Corner for Stores Dallas Blink. I'm just going to call him Blink. Corner for Blink. It's swung in and cleared away. Lil Lilovo. I need to call him Lil Lovo, but he's our player. Strand takes a shot. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. What is going on? I don't get it. Langerland free kick. It's a good save from Sandberg. Nothing's changed. All that's changed is it's been about two days since I've played football manager, and all of a sudden, we're shit. <laughs> Cross swung in. Corner swung in, rather. Salt wins a free kick on the edge of the area. This... Is, is, this is scoring range, Bettini. Come on, Bettini. Come on. Come on, Bettini. Straight at the wall. Come on, man. Langeland picks up the loose ball. End of the highlight. End of the highlight. What has happened? 
What was that? When was it last time? It was Friday. Well, Friday was brilliant. Can we go back to Friday? Because Sunday, Sunday, shite, rubbish. What is uh, <laughs> corner swung in, cleared away? Olafsson is on it for blink. That was just completely done. Race. He's given away a penalty. You having a laugh? Fuck me. Ugh. They haven't won in five. They've not won in five. We've rucked up and given them three goals. Gidamini, corner, swung in, cleared away. Salt, race, consolate. Again, the 3-1 at the last... Uh. Oh, I'm actually fuming. I don't want to see that. I don't want to see that. What's happened to Helm? I said Helm was really good and he's just fallen off the pace. You're all shit. <laughs> Dreadful. 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 I don't believe it. Actually don't believe it. That was really unlucky. Thought we were the better side, to be honest. Are you blind, Ole Frederick Paulson? You f moron. Actually terrible. Actually terrible. I'm not I'm not going to that press conference either. Nope. Oh my god. I don't get it. I don't get how we've become so rubbish so quickly. I joked at the start of the episode that was oh, this is probably going to be one of those ones where we lose two in a row. We've lost two in a row! I can understand kind of losing to Viking, but not this. Not this. No. Right. When are we coming back? We will come back for the first leg of the Fuller Derby against Grarud and then Asan Fot Fotbal uh, as well. Yes, those two games. Garud and Asan. I will see you soon for those two games. Hopefully I'll have calmed down after this shocking, shocking performance of this episode and um, we'll, have, we'll have won some more games. That would be nice. Uh, thank you for watching the episode. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, let me know what you thought. down. If you did, let me know what you thought down in the comments. Leave a like on the video. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. And I'll see you soon for some more. Cheers. All the best. Bye. Pissing. Right, I was so close to snapping my neck.